going to take a balloon and try and make it stick to the wall. Okay. Regardless of how hard I try or how much I want it to, the balloon is not going to stick. But what if I go ahead and rub the balloon against my hair? Now it does stick. I'm not doing anything to the balloon right now. It's sticking there all on its own. Why do you think that's happening? To figure out what's going on, let's compare this to a similar situation. Let me make this book stick to the wall and not fall down. Okay? If I let go, it falls on its own. But if I push hard enough, the, the book doesn't fall. If I release it enough, it will start to slide down. Why do you think that's happening? And how is that similar to what's going on right here? For our next phenomena, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take two balloons that are suspended by strings from the ceiling, and I'm going to rub them with this fur. And then notice how they can't come back together. Before I rubbed them, they were both hanging straight down. Now they're both hanging at a little bit of an angle with their, from the string. Why do you think that's happening? I can also rub my hand with the fur. And I can make the balloon come towards my hand. Notice how I'm not touching the balloon at all, but it's still coming towards my hand. Why do you think that's happening? And why are the balloons pushing away from each other, but they're coming towards my hand? If I try and make them touch, they push apart. But why do they come towards me? This device is called a Van de Graaff generator. Watch what happens when I turn it on. Notice how sparks are traveling from the big globe onto this metal sphere that I'm holding. If I get too close, there are smaller continual sparks, and the sparks go away if I touch the metal sphere to the globe. And then as I move it away, I get bigger and bigger sparks. It's like I'm creating lightning. Why do you think that's happening? What do you think is happening on the surface of the sphere when I turn this on to make this happen? 